County art student is making dinosaurs come alive. Now she's created lifelike versions of the prehistoric creatures. Eyewitness News reporter Lauren Hensley is live in Bloomsburg with more. Lauren. Kelly and Chris, this is such perfect timing having Pennsylvania dinosaurs with us as we're getting ready for a brand new Jurassic Park movie. So gotta ask, woo! <laughs> Man, that will wake you up. So got to ask some of our friends here. Do you have a favorite part of Jurassic Park? Um, when the boy and girl were in the um, lab and they were trying to get away from a little um, dinosaur. You heard that tapping of his toe, right? And that's what these guys are, Velociraptors. Did you have a favorite part? Yeah, I, remember, I loved when the newest dinosaur, the smart one, got eaten by the big, big um, sea monster. I That part was very gratifying. <laughs> Glad that big dinosaur didn't get the people. Coming over to you, Mark, dad back here. So when your daughter, Mackenzie, came to you and said she was going to make seven, eight foot tall dinosaurs, what did you think? I wasn't sure what to think. <laughs> I didn't know what everything was. So, uh, you know, once I saw the pictures, it was great. And Eric, what is your favorite dinosaur of all time? Ooh, uh I really like the impressive skull of the Triceratops. I love it. Very impressive. So Mackenzie, we got to ask you when there's a new movie like Jurassic Park that comes out, mm -hmm. um, you know, what do things look for like for Pennsylvania dinosaurs? Well, there's definitely a very boost in interest now uh, because people see these dinosaurs and you kind of get sucked into the world that like these dinosaurs aren't around anymore, but you still want to be with them. And then they realize that there are ways to be around life-size dinosaurs. So there's definitely a very good spike in interest when it comes to a, a franchise like this coming out with a new movie and having these guys. And you mentioned Lucy is regarded as maybe one of the more ferocious oh, ones. Oh yeah, she's definitely one of the ferocious Whoa. ones. <laughs> but she also has a little reputation of being the dancing dinosaur. Oh, she does. She loves to dance. So let's go ahead and see Lucy's. <laughs> if Lucy had a favorite song to dance to Mackenzie, what do you think it would be? Oh, she does love Cake by the Ocean. Cake by the Ocean, one of my all-time <laughs> favorites. So are you going to see the new Jurassic Park when it comes out? Oh, without a doubt. <laughs> one of my all-time favorite franchise, and i got to tell you, uh, these things are just so incredible to see in person. So if you want to check them out, mark your calendars. July 21st and 22nd at Clyde Peeling's Reptile Zoo. The dinosaurs, they're going to be busy all summer long, so when they're close to home, you really want to take the opportunity to see them in person. Dinosaurs Alive, reporting live in Bloomsburg, Lauren Hensley. I Witness News. Lucy the dancing dinosaur. Gotta love it. Certainly do look alive too. I think mm. it's interesting. We don't know what dinosaurs actually sounded like.